Welcome to a video tutorial for Active Inspire 1.5. Today we're looking at adding objects into your resource library. If you use an object over and over again, you find something you like or you make something that you like and you know you'll use it time and time again, it's a good idea to save it in your resource browser. And in your browser menu, which you can bring up as I have here, second button along is the resource browser. Now you can have your browser or sh with your resources in it or shared resources. If you click on my resources, then you can save. You can just drag the object into the menu bar and you can save it. Now I am going to set up a new folder for elements for the periodic table. So I'm a chemistry teacher. So I can go in here, I can go create a new folder and call it elements. And it comes up in my collections. I believe I saved it to my collections. There it is, elements. And I can open that folder and it's empty at the moment. Now I can just drag my elements in. And they're there. And you can see at the moment it's called resource.as4. Well, I can right click on that and rename that and I can call it hydrogen or and I should say I can do the same for the other one called aluminium Oops. and then when I do a search it will find hydrogen or aluminium 